it's time to say this. It's time to be honest. It's time to say something that could go against the thousands, hundreds of thoughts. But I have to do this. I don't believe in 3D. I said it. I said it. It's too late to, to retreat, to go back. But wait. Relax. Take a deep breath. Put your pitchforks in place and listen. I said 3D, not VR, not 360, only 3D because I don't believe in it. I don't believe in it because it's uncomfortable not only to record, and we'll talk about this later, but especially to watch because you, just, you know, you just can't take your smartphone wherever you are and watch a 3D video or watch a 3D picture because you always have to use something like this. This is a VR headset, you just put your phone inside it and if you want to know, this is a VR Oasis which is probably the best VR headsets like um, price, quality ratio because there are also headphones you just put the jack inside, inside your phone and you can listen also uh, while you are watching so link in the description but you have always used these kind of things like a VR headsets with the smartphone or the standalone ones like Oculus Go or the Skyworth or you can just take a couple of glasses to watch it and uh, like keep it in hand but it's a bit weird and uncomfortable and you always have to bring them with you but you have to always use these kind of things because you can just take your smartphone and watch a 3D picture on it like it works for 360 or I don't know VR some VR contents created in digital uh, you just can't open a picture like this on your computer and um, a 3d picture or a 3d video on your computer and watch it properly uh, you just can't bring these kind of things wherever you want because they are big they are massive you, you can bring with you a couple of glasses but uh, then when you have to take a look at the picture at the 3d picture uh, it's really uncomfortable you have to place your phone you have to keep it in hands and uh, you would not do this every time you need to take a to, to watch a 3d video and if you want to watch a 3d video it would be really uncomfortable to watch it with the glasses so you have to use one of these things and uh, come on Let's be honest, would you bring this thing in the bus? Because I would not, probably someone would, <laughs> but I would not and probably the most of you would not. The 3D died already once with the movies and now it, com it came back with the, with the 360 3D cameras or 1080 3D cameras because now we just have a, like a Vue XR or Insta360 Evo, Kenda or Kukam which records in both 360 and 3D and you can create interesting 3D contents but would you watch them? And let's make a step back because of course I'm not saying that 3D sucks because 3D is really cool, it's really interesting to watch it, it makes you feel the depth of the, um, of the moment the depth of the image of the video it's really cool it's it's, uh, it's really interesting to watch it in 3d but it's uncomfortable and if you if you have never watched a 3d video you can't understand this and if you want to take a look at the 3d video if you have a vr headset and you have never used it for 3d not 360 uh, you can I leave you in the description the link to the video made by Ben Claremont which made a comparison and a, a big video for 3d and it's really interesting because you watch it in 3D and uh, you can understand the depth and uh, how it works. So, um, link in the description, go towards the video. And of course, it's really interesting, but you always have to do to wear a VR headset. And this is not comfortable when you have to show something to more people. It's not like showing a 360 picture that you just take it, take your smartphone, tap twice on the on the gallery and you can show it to everyone in the same time. And um, even if it's not in the same time, they just can uh, scroll around the picture and it's really, it's really easy to show and to spread 360 pictures. It's not the same for 3D. Also, it's hard to upload 3D contents because you can't just uh, upload your 3D picture on Facebook because it's not compatible with it and you have to, to search for particular websites or you have to upload your videos on YouTube because you can do only this probably and uh, it's really hard to to reach the other people with 3D and they have to uh, to be to have the equipment to have the uh, the VR headset to watch it so it's really it's really hard 
marketplace I'd say because not a lot of people can be reached with 3D it's really hard to do this more or less um, and this is one of the reasons for which I don't record in 3D and I, I, I honestly I don't believe in it I wanted to try okay I have to say this I have never recorded a 3D video because I have I have never had a 3D camera so this is, could be this could be a part of problem but honestly it's already hard to spread this technology it's already there are a lot of problems with 3d and the other aspect is the recording of 3d videos because 3d uh, at the beginning you had to use two cameras now there are cameras like uh, views xr and uh, insta360 evo kind of cool that allows you to record directly a 3d video and it's really easy to do it to do this but it's not that easy to reach a lot of people with 3d and this is why i don't believe in it because in the marketplace the first thing you have to 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 know to do is to reach the audience because if you can't reach it's if it's hard to reach the audience if it's hard to make the audience watch your contents you will never go ahead and uh, we all know this and i can't believe in something that i can't share with someone else because let's be honest 3d is really hard to share and if you can't reach your audience in an easy way if you can't let the audience watch your content in an easy way you would not reach a lot of audience. And if I can't reach a lot of audience with my content, probably it doesn't worth doing them. Because uh, if you if you take a lot of times, if you buy a new camera to make something that like uh, could be watched from 12 people, probably it doesn't worth it. Because if you can spend less and you can share better content with a 360 camera or a VR environment that you can create on your computer, and you can reach literally everyone because everyone can watch a 360 picture, a 360 video on their own smartphone or also on YouTube or on VR or, or on uh, Kula. doesn't matter. It's really easy to do this in 360. It's really hard and very, very, very hard to do this in 3D. And this is one of the reasons for which you don't watch a lot of videos on, on YouTube in 3D because you watch mostly flat, uh, flat videos or 360 videos but not in 3D and this is why I don't believe in it and in my opinion we will not see a lot of 3D cams anymore probably someone would do this would do like a, a better camera, a better 3D camera but only one camera or two examples uh, from other brands but probably the main brands would not do other 3D cameras because uh, it doesn't worth it so this is what I think about 3D Write a comment below, let me know what do you think about it, if you believe in 3D, if you not, why, why yes and why not. Write a comment below, thank you for watching, see you in the next.